Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the new NFL, where all 32 teams have been relocated to a brand new city and every NFL player becomes a free agent. All the new 32 teams are gonna have bidding wars and be able to send contract offers to all the players to try and build their own team from scratch. Each team was given $256 million to make their bids. My team, you guys might ask, is the Oklahoma City Blues, the first NFL team ever in Oklahoma City I'm gonna be representing. Guys, if you like this concept, you want a year two, you want this to continue, and at the end of this or the beginning of this, you want to see a second year. 10,000 likes, we get 10,000 likes, I'll make sure year two's out right away. This took a ton of time to set up, so shout out to everyone who helped out. Guys, God bless. The NFL is about to reset. Ladies and gentlemen, I just want you to look at the screen right now. Guys, every single player in the NFL is a free agent. This is the official new NFL. We have relocated all 32 NFL teams, meaning that every single roster is in a brand new city. The NFL is no more. We have the Dreadnoughts, the Elks, the Golden Eagles, the Huskies, the Lumberjacks, the Monarchs. There's nobody has any contracts and how the teams are gonna be decided. Every single NFL player became a free agent and we are about to have an absolutely massive bidding war to create our teams. Now guys, this took ages for them to do. I want this to be a multi-season franchise. And if you think this is a good idea and you wanna see this again, or if you wanna see just a season two of this league, the 32 users league, please kill like button. 10,000, like I said, work from a ton of different people went into making this happen. I am, I wanna introduce my team quickly before I kind of talk too much. I am the Oklahoma City Blues. Um, I love their uniforms. They're super blue. They kind of have two-tone. They're really, really, really freaking cool. And I love them. We're going to be competing against a lot of these guys. Like I said, the Golden Eaters, the, the Huskies, the Dreadnought. The only team that you'll actually notice is the same is the Panthers, but it's in a new city. You can't, there isn't enough logos to do this completely. Guys, it's time to go to free agency. Okay, let's talk this through. So I'm sure a lot of these guys already, yeah, Patrick Sertan, 10 bids, 3 bids. Essentially, you can do five bids every single round. Now, there, there's strategy behind this. You're starting an entirely new team from scratch. You only get to negotiate with five people. How do you spend your money? Who do you go after? Who is most important to your team where you feel like that player can transform? We are a year in the future, so some of these guys have superstars. Bryce Young, CJ Stroud, do you want them to be your quarterback? There is a million freaking questions now how i am planning on running the blues and let's let's kind of go through every single position we have 262 million to spend and you can spend it on whatever you want you can you can technically go out and offer a super max to patrick mahomes but then you're not going to be as good at other positions how i want to do this and how i want to start is i want to look db wise um there's jalen ramsey Lattimore. i want to go the first person who i feel like would be a really 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 good fit is Marshawn or Marlon Humphrey has a podcast uh, with Snapback Sports. If you guys watch uh, Jack from Snapback Sports, um, has a really cool podcast um, that he does. I am going to start off by going after Marlon because no one else is bidding on him. That's kind of the way I want to move in plain sight. I want to look for the people, and now that there's two people have bidded on him, but I want to look for people that are going to be unnoticed. Devin Witherspoon's a superstar in this situation. He's a friend of the channel. He just let me know the other day that he watches my videos. He said he watches my videos every day. I was like, bro, I love you, man. Um, 23 years old. I don't know if he's going to get a ton of interest. I'm going to offer him a player friend. Let's just throw some bids out there. Now, DBs are always so important. Safeties in this game are crazy important. And what you're going to notice is a lot of people are going to ignore the safety position. It's going to be really, really, really slept on. So someone like Minka Fitzpatrick to me is a game breaker. He's crazy on defense. And what I want my new NFL team being the Oklahoma City Blues to be known for is defense. So I'm going to offer Minka Fitzpatrick a contract. We'll see how these age as they go. Jesse Bates is another one who's an absolute stud. So currently my contracts are Minka, Marlin, and Witherspoon. And we're the top on both of them. We're going after players that nobody else is going after. So hopefully we can go five for five. Now back to the quarterback position. Trevor Lawrence. He's only a superstar, but bro, I would love to get Trevor Lawrence. 
Trevor Lawrence is the winningest quarterback in TD Barrett franchise history. Now, I would be going 7 by 30 because I'm pretty sure someone else is going to bid on him. But he is the winningest quarterback that I have ever had. I have never... I won five Super Bowls with Trevor Lawrence once. Um, Devin Weatherspoon, it looks like I got a little bit of confidence. That's why I'm going aggressive with my initial bids. Trevor Lawrence has crazy throw power. He's not an X factor, so he's going to be a little bit ignored in this round one. Um, and you're kind of noticing that right now. Lamar, Josh Allen's only got one bid. Herbert's only got one. Maybe I need to rethink this. I do think maybe I need to rethink this because everyone wants Mahomes and everyone wants Lamar. I'm guessing that bid is so high that no one can compete with it. What about team interest? Who of these big time QBs wants to play for us? I wonder if I could secure Lamar. Five offers. The thing is, Lamar, this is the risk. This is the this is the game we play. I'm gonna get rid of this. Oh my, this is kind of a time thing. Bruh! Oh, this is so difficult because this is the risk you play because I go after, it's a wasted first round bid if I don't get them. I'd rather go defense and worry about QB in the next round. There's a lot of depth here. CJ Stroud, but all of them are gonna be gone. That's the problem. But like, because everyone's bidding so aggressively, I could probably get some, like look, look at this. I could get some studs. This is to me playing chess, not checkers. Max Crosby currently has no bids on him and he's a 99 overall. Neither does Chris Jones. Everyone's going after the fancy positions. Why don't I spend my money on stacking my defensive line? Why don't I offer a player friendly to Chris Jones? Quinnen Williams is a little younger, isn't he? No, I think they're similar. Chris Jones is just a stud. And why don't I offer a bag to Max Crosby out of Eastern Michigan? And then in the second round, we worry about our quarterback. So right now, my targeted are all people that the other 32 teams aren't really looking at. If I could get all of these guys, our defense would be crazy. Now, the only one that I would change maybe is I might withdraw my Chris Jones one and I might instead look for like Buddha Baker. But oh, Bates Motel, I love Jesse Bates on this team. This isn't the flashiest like plan, but it's actually, I think it's a smart plan. I honestly think that we'll, I'll thank myself for this. Like Quinn and Williams is younger and 97 overall. He does want 27 million a year. I'd love to bring in Quinn and Williams. So to me, this is going to be my strategy. I am going to go after all the players that the rest of the guys don't want. Witherspoon, Humphrey, Minka, Quinn. And we're going to go all defense. The blues are going to be built on defense and I'll worry about offense later. Look at how many people have bid on Jefferson. All these guys are going to be available in the second round. I'm going to go all in. Give, I'm going to give this a little while because there's still time. But as of right now, these are my bids. We'll see what happens. Okay, so advance is in like one minute. Um, still, nobody is like after the same players. Everyone wants Patrick Sertan. I am, I'm glad that I'm not going like, who will be left? Tua will be left. Dak. CJ won't be there. I'm gonna try and go after Kyler Murray round two, I think, or Richardson. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna do QB round two. Currently, this looks like a good strategy. We'll see if we get all these guys. Oh my gosh, this is literally gonna determine how good the Blues are. It is going to be determined right now. Did we get it? We have 161 million in cap left. Did my strategy of laying, playing it for a lot of the guys who weren't as famous worked? Boom, 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 boom. Guys, literally love this strategy. OKC is all about defense. We get Mad Max Crosby, who's going to be playing for us. Kind of an underrated, absolute super, super stud. Quinnen Williams is going to be right next to him. An absolute beast. X Factor. Love him. I didn't go flashy. I didn't get a receiver. I didn't go for the fastest DBs. I went for two of the slower superstar DBs. I didn't bid after the crazy ones, and I got Marlon and Devin Weatherspoon, which are crazy, and I get my user, my favorite user. When I found out I was getting to create my own team, kind of, um, I'll, you gotta have your favorite user, man. Minka Fitzpatrick is a TD Barrett guy. Been around a long time. Okay, round number two. 
there's going to be a lot less players, but there's going to be a lot of disappointed people who did not get all five. Now, if you get in those bidding wars with people, Sertan went there, Micah Parsons there, Garrett. Um, if you get in bidding wars with everybody, you're not going, holy moly, Mahomes didn't sign. Oh my gosh, Mahomes didn't sign. A lot of these guys didn't sign. Okay, so this round we also only have five bids. You're not allowed to bid ten times a round. You're only allowed to build bid five around. Okay, let's let's have a look here. Okay, so the quarterback that I kind of wanted the most, I really wanted Kyler Murray to be my quarterback. I just um, I've always been a big fan of Kyler Murray, and I I feel like he could be, but he'll be available. But I don't know if I do need to worry about wide receiver now. A lot of them are around. Iron Mike Williams. Chris Godwin, Zay Flowers, George Pickens, T. Higgins. T. Higgins, if I ever don't put you on my team. This is where money starts to get interesting, though, because money's about to get tight. Like, money is about to get a little bit interesting. T. Higgins, 88 speed. Okay. I'm happy with that. Mike Williams. Is there anyone with speed here that could just be a good, like, right there? Boom. I only get five bids, but, like. That guy's a glitch. But Hollywood's going to be the one who's going to be cheap. Hollywood at $13 million. Nicole, Calvin. Shahid's a stud, actually. I want Hollywood on my team. Friend of the channel, I'm going to go Hollywood Brown. Um, just, we'll see. I always find he makes big-time catches for us. What about the tight end position? If we're not getting a superstar, the other... I just cannot believe how many players are not signed at this very moment. Luke Musgrave. Okay, let's go back to the defense. TJ Watt didn't get a signing. Gary and Reddick both don't have a ton of interest. What about Daniil at 20 million? Very criminally underrated. Reddick at 28. Khalil Mack. Alex Highsmith, Trayvon Walker, 13 a year, Denzel Ward, AJ Terrell. See, Denzel Ward isn't going to get a lot of interest because he's not a superstar, but he is a beast. Like, like he doesn't necessarily even need to be a superstar is kind of the way I look at it. Oh, Saquon, four offers. Devontae, Dexter Lawrence. Guys, you're seeing me really, the wheels are spinning here. I don't know who to, I'm going after T. Higgins and Hollywood. I'm way outbid for Hollywood now. So I'm going to back off of Hollywood because I can't spend much more than that on him. Jonathan Taylor is a beast. Like, especially if I'm not going all in on offense. I haven't paid a quarterback yet. Let's see where I will be if I paid a quarterback. Justin Fields, Mac Jones. Did someone grab Anthony Richardson at the, like, the last second? No, they didn't. Richardson still doesn't have a lot of interest. He's 21. I, want, I just picture Kyler Murray as my quarterback. Even though that might hurt us, I've always wanted like a long... He's In this game, I just love Kyler Murray. So let, let's bid on him. He doesn't have much interest. Let's As of right now, let's go after him and see kind of what that looks like. Amari Cooper, I do need some speed. If I'm going with that, all these like really fast guys are getting a ton of interest. That's where a lot of people are just going all in on speed. Christian Watson is going to get an absolute like bag. I don't know if any of them interest me at that level. I just don't know. Chris Olave does. But as a one of five bids, probably not this round. Let's, let's go tight end. TJ, Dallas Goddard. Let's let's Evan Ingram. Superstar tight end, Evan Ingram, no bids. Let's go aggressive and try and make a play for Evan Ingram in this round. I like that because I feel like he'll be helpful. Will Anderson's a stud. He's only 27. He wants 16 million. You know what? Rather than going after a superstar, wouldn't I be smart to try and... If I make him a superstar, he's literally will be the best player in the league. That's the difference. How much does he want? 16 a year, though. 
Oh, or I go safe with Russo. Guys, oh my gosh, this is too much. Donald's got bids. Jeffrey Simmons, Aiden Hutchinson has no bids, but 19 a year. Part of me wants to use one of my bids to save a little bit of money just to guarantee something. I love Jalen Johnson. DJ Turner, two bids. Banks closed, got a bid. Forbes, two. Dante Jackson, Caleb Farley. Caleb Farley has no bids. I just don't know if he's worth it when we do only have five bids this round. I honestly really want Will Anderson on the belt. He's only 21. I'm just going to throw a normal bid at him because I think he can make my defense insane. Like, give him a little bit. Once again, we're going after players that are just a little bit less sought after right now. Like, just kind of playing it a little bit safe. Kyler Murray, nobody else wants Kyler Murray. How? What's his... Ex Oh, now I'm thinking of Kyler Murray's the best long-term option. I feel like Kyler Murray's too expensive for what I'm getting. I don't know what his XP is. I could go rich. Anthony Richardson's a great Madden quarterback. He, it's early to go after him because Mahomes is obviously still here. But I think I am going to. Yeah, I think Richards. I'd be very happy with Richardson as my QB. Oh, but then I always wanted Kyler. Okay. A couple more bids here. I, I got to figure out who I want at quarterback. Brian Burns is the only one left. I've looked through this entire thing, and Brian Burns is the only one left with no offers. But then I'm down to $71 million. That's not even with my QB. Not I took away a quarterback offer, didn't I? Holy, you guys are seeing me fight this. I took away one of these. I like the idea of this is my offense. I just, I've already had Richardson. I think I'd, I'd really, really, really love a Kyler Murray franchise. I have to be honest. Whether or not it's the right decision, I got to go with the player that I'm most excited to have on my team, and that's Kyler Murray. I'm like... I really, really, really want to play a season with Kyler Murray. Okay, who's the best player here with no offers? CMC. Gross. CMC's got nobody? Running backs get no love, though. CD Lamb, one offer. Let's, let's go all in for CD Lamb. You know what? We're going to take a risk. CD Lamb, okay. Cross your fingers, guys. Let's hope we get these guys. 48 million. Guys, I, my strategy is unfreaking matched in this. Did we go five for five again? Five for five, baby. Bruh, let's go. Five for freaking five. Kyler Murray. We now have Kyler Murray, CD Lamb, T Higgins, and Evan Ingram. Um, I think those are all big time signings. We get Will Anderson and Max Crosby, Quinn and Williams in the middle. We are light on a lot of positions. O-line, we spent no money on, and we are as close to broke as broke is. Um, we really don't got a lot. And this is where it gets interesting because you need your second, like I currently have one DB, right? I have one DB. So it's like, at this point, I don't have a ton of money because I've spent a lot of money. I've already spent a ridiculous amount of money on some of these players. And then now you take your remaining 40 million because we went all in on a lot of these guys. You take your remaining 40 million and you try and make the best of it because as of right now, I'm broke and a lot of my DBs aren't that fast. So maybe instead of going after Farley, I, I play this safe and I go down a little bit and I try and get some uh, more people who know what he are, is gonna want. So like a Dory Jackson, 27 years old. Nobody's gonna want a Dory Jackson except me because I literally love the guy. Um, scroll down, go to the slower DBs with Stardev. Awuzie, Benjamin St. Juice, um, huge TD Barrett guy, also a Canadian. Love it. Targeted, boom. We'll see about these three. Farley, um, my offer is not nearly as good as the other guys. I'm going to back off. I'm not going to get Farley. I can totally understand that. Now let's look at linemen because our linemen are absolutely in shambles. Who are the linemen that I can get? Look, they all want $20 million a year. I don't have $20 million left. I got to scroll down to try and find the guys who I could get for cheaper. So like someone like Anton Harrison out of Oklahoma. Let's just go neutral. 
my strategy of going the very player friendly has worked. But now I have this much money and I have no tackles. So I'm trying to utilize this la this last little these last dollars that I have to try and get some decent players. I think I got to drop to like the seven range. Let's go maybe George Fant. Yeah, I like that. Okay. I don't have a running back currently. CMC is still there. I can't afford any of these guys. So I got I got to go cheap on a running back. Like a 6 million a year guy. Kenneth wants way too much. Pacheco wants too much. Matt Burita. See, this this is where it gets interesting cuz I don't have the dollars for one of these crazy running backs. James Cook, 6 a year. Singletary, Walker, Jameer Gibbs, 6 a year. Anthony McFarlane, Clyde, Elijah Mitchell, Boston Scott, Tajay Spears. Boom, this is who I want. Five a year, the Tennessee Titan. He's a beast for the Titans. I'm going to try and get Tajay Spears. We now, the last thing that I think we need to try and attack here is someone with a little bit of speed. Trey Palmer. Um, a lot of other guys already got their speedy receivers. I'm going to offer Trey Palmer $4 million. He can be our little bit of a speed guy in this offense. Let's go after him. Holy moly, what do I got? Six million left. I'm gonna be so broke, man. How broke are you? So broke. Just a stupid level of broke. Do I try? Oh, do I try and sneak? Superstar kickers are so underrated. Two million. Oh, that would actually be a really low key good decision. That would be a really good decision. Right now. All these guys, once again, are mine. They all they all want to play here. Let's go for one more. I'm going to go for a kicker. It's kind of my last. I, I don't think a lot of people... I got 3.2 left. That's it. It's all the money I got. Cross our fingers, guys. I think we played this pretty well. Okay, guys. Success. In our final round, I believe we got those guys. Okay. It's time to look at... My new creation, an 81 overall team. Little bit top heavy, but not really. Okay, quarterback. None other than, I had to pay him a lot of money. And honestly, it's because I've, I've always wanted him on my team. I, Kyler Murray is just such a cool quarterback to use. I used to love him in regs. We got our guy, Oklahoma, brings in Kyler. Did he go? To, no. Whoa. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I'm wrong, aren't I? Dude, he went to Oklahoma. He went to Oklahoma. He played. I knew it. Him and Hollywood both did. For whatever reason, I knew I was doing something right for a reason. Okay. Beautiful. Oklahoma to Oklahoma. That's so sick. Running back Tajay Spears could not be happier with that. He's a stud for the Titans. His change of direction, I absolutely love. Underrated guy. Receiver, CD and T. Higgins, two underrated players once again. I told you how I was going to play this. Oh my gosh, we got our upgrades from the last season. Um, I told you guys how I was going to play this entire thing. And I was like, yo, I'm going to be straight up. You're not going to see me going after Patrick Mahomes or Josh Allen. I'm going to go after all the people that nobody wants and try and create a really well-balanced attack. I think we did an excellent, excellent, excellent job of that. Um, especially on our secondary. Um... T. Higgins, C.D. Lamb might have some upgrades. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do about all these. Yeah, he's gets one upgrade. Um, C.D. Lamb's gonna be our main guy. He's a cowboy, someone I've wanted to like have on my team for a while. Um, he gets abilities as well. And then at tight end, we get Evan Ingram, who I was low key a little shocked there wasn't a bit more interest for Ingram. The reason is, and I was the more I dug into it. I don't think his possession is only he's only one away from getting tight end apprentice. Yeah, I don't I don't understand it. I honestly feel like he was kind of like in one overall upgrade, he'll get a bit like I think this was a steal. I truly think this was a steal. And you won't convince me otherwise. Like I think this could go down as one of the ones like I can already get slot apprentice on him. I can get grab and go, short in, like Evan Ingram's going to be a huge... Please, kill... I want multiple seasons of this team to see how it works. Left tackle, we got Anton Harrison. Um, we don't have any guards. They're all going to be CPU signed and then George fans. Um, nah, nah, nah. Okay. We got Mad Max at left end and Will Anderson. Mentor, mentor. Mentor, mentee. Like, 
boom, boom. Love them both. Um, Will Anderson being 21 and already an 87 overall, like, is literally what made me be like, yeah, I need him on the team. Plus, I was just, I think he's a cool player. Quinn and Williams in the middle. Um, Tavius Robinson. Marlon Humphrey. Devin Witherspoon. Adoree Jackson. And Benjamin St. Just. Um, Minka Fitzpatrick up top. And then no other safeties other than Minka Fitzpatrick, which we're going to have to probably change in the in the bargain bin. And I was smart, and I went after a kicker in the time, and we got Co. Now, we're going to go to regular season. We're going to look at everyone's team. There is no NFL draft, in case you guys are wondering. The, the draft, we just put zero overall players. This is the squad we're going to battle with. <sighs> okay, see you guys in a minute. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> Start off by playing against Patrick Mahomes. We're going to go through his roster. First off, I want to show the teams. Blues, Snow... Oh my... It's so freaking weird. I want to show our division. Blues, Snowhawks, Armadillos, and Desperate. I'm actually going to take a picture live on camera here. So I, I don't mess this up because... I want to go through the teams that we're going to play most. So the Blues, you obviously know our squad. Um, the Snowhawks... Got Sertan, Adams, Herbert, Baker, ETN, Highsmith, Rousseau, Everett. They don't have a lot of depth. Okay. The Armadillos got Trey White, DK Metcalf, Trayvon Diggs, Tyron Matthew. Okay. I would say they got Aaron Rodgers and Thibodeau. I would say we did better than them. And then the Desperados have Lamar Jackson, Jamar Chase, Tristan Wirfs, Daniil Hunter, and then a Pretty decent drop off, but what looks like a pretty good squad. Now we are playing, I believe, the River Hogs. Who the heck am I playing? The Shamrocks? I can't. I can't figure out the teams, man. I'm gonna lose it. Who am I playing? Like, who is this? SDG. Said what? SDG, what is that? What is SDG? Golden Eagles. Bro, how am I supposed I guess that is a Golden Eagle. Let's go to our first opponent. We're going to set our official depth chart of this team. But let's go. Sorry, it's going to take me a while to get used to the fact that there is literally no one I recognize. Okay. Oh, brother. Okay, this guy did well. Paid Patrick Mahomes a bag. Jameer Gibbs. Receivers literally... Oh, you better hit free agency before we start this game. Oh, he sold free agency. He got I think he ran out of money. Montez, Aaron Donald, Dexter Lawrence. I think he was I, I think the dude I think he ran out of money. Like look at it, no depth. Like no depth. But I'm sure he's gonna sign some receivers before we play. Um okay. Let's go do our official depth chart. Smile as we do it because this is freaking fun and I love my job. This is the new NFL. We are the Oklahoma City Blues. Kyler Murray at quarterback. One, two, three. Um, Keaton Mitchell at running back. Absolutely not. It's got to be, you got to do the reorder thing or else it'll get super messed up. Um, Tajay Spears at running back could not be happier. CD, T. Higgins, and Trey Palmer. Beautiful one, two, three. Evan Ingram. This is where we're brutal. Um, I did sign some like just... CPU, sign, like just some people who didn't get picked up. Our line's really bad. Mad Max at left end, Will Anderson at right end, Quinn and Williams in the middle. That's a beast of like those three. That is a brilliant combination. Marlo, Witherspoon, Adoree Jackson, and Ben St. Just. Um, up top, we got Tevin Harrison. They did a rookie draft, and we're not going to get rid of them. It's such a pain to try and. So you might see some random rookies, but you won't see a ton of rookies on these teams. Um, I'm considering playing Ben maybe up top, but I don't, I don't really know. Um, my user is going to be none other than Minka Fitzpatrick. Secondary, Ryan Neal. Obviously, those are my two users. Slot cornerback is going to be, let's go Devin Witherspoon. That's kind of his, like, that's kind of his toughness. That's sort of, sort of what he does. Holy doly, that was a lot of talking. Guys, new NFL starts right now. Opening day keys to victory. I'm going to go run the ball. I'm going to try and just... Eat away at the clock. Make sure to make good decisions. We're going to say dominating offense, but I'm actually, I want to try and get Tajay Spears as involved as possible. Just see what we're going up against. This guy's front seven's bizarre, um, so it's not going to be easy. But week one, let's go. Holy mo, dude, you cannot tell me this is not kind of sick. Literally, entirely new teams. 
everywhere. Will Anderson, first play. Well, oh, no. Look, like Anderson, one of the only non-superstars I went after in those first two rounds, I think it's going to pay dividends. Like, I, he can become a superstar, and I know he can become a beast. Our front, look at our right side of our line. That's terrifying. And I love these jerseys, man. The Blues jersey. Oh. Cut it, cut it. Boom. Will Anderson. Devin Weatherspoon, if you watch Seahawks games, you know that's not unrealistic. If you watch Seahawks games, you know what you just saw is not unrealistic. I'm going to be blitzing him off the edge. Um, is a big part of the way that I want to use Devin Witherspoon, just kind of in creative ways, um, utilizing how like good his hit power is and stuff like that um, to try and make him as good as possible. Okay, we got a chance to get off the field. I love these uniforms, dude. Imagine I make Oklahoma City the new dynasty. Oof. Dang, literally you leave them just the tiniest. Oh, that's crazy. Ayuk. It's actually probably Ayuk's favorite route that he runs IRL. Dude, you get fourth downs, man. So crazy how this game works sometimes. That fourth down situation where he threw it to Cook. Okay, for the first time we see Kyler. That's just Patrick Mahomes, though, being Patrick Mahomes. Dude, Kyler looks so tough in these uniforms. Tajay Spears, go. Go. Shoot. Oh, my. There we go. Evan Ingram. Evan Ingram is going to go down as the one that everyone in the league, I, I think, is going to be like... That one, we should not have let Brett get Evan Ingram. And maybe I'm just talking. Sometimes I just sit out here and I talk. But. Good throw. Good job, Trey. Trey Palmer. First out. Look at this D line, though. Somebody move things. T. Higgins. Nope. Nope. Nobody want to move. Nobody want to move. CD Lamb. Let's go. The first touchdown for the OKC. That's crazy how well my really brutal offensive line just held up against Aaron Donald and company. That's crazy. Okay. Seven up. Oh, my gosh. That's where I'm getting absolutely toasted as a Dory Jackson on these play actions. Oh, brother. Okay. Go, Saints! Oh. Marlon, you are, no matter what, you're a fan favorite of mine. I've always loved Marlon Humphrey. Even though the Titans and Ravens are big rivals. Okay. He definitely knows that I don't want to take a timeout. I can just tell. CD Lamp. He's going to get a field goal either way. I'd actually rather play good red zone defense. As crazy as this is, I'd rather play good red zone defense than have to... Like, if I kick it, he's going to have 30 seconds and three timeouts in Patrick Mahomes. And I haven't come, I haven't really stopped him yet. So, to me, I'd rather take the risk here. We have some big-time receivers. Try and get some good blocks and look for T. Higgins over the middle is honestly what I'm thinking. Can you catch that one, CD? Love you, man. Freaking laser. Good job, CD Lamb! Pressure is honestly what's killing us the most, more than anything right now. That's a beam. Just catch it. No, you don't really mess with Patrick Sertan. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take the field goal now. I could try something, but it's just going to end up in an interception. We do get ball at a half. We'll have a chance to take the lead. Let's just play it smart. Take three. Yeah, got him. Okay. Decent half. Our defense is struggling, though. Go, go. This is Kyler, this is where you're Kyler, bro. Slide, 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 slide. 
That is where Kyler Murray... Like, that's why I got him. I know no, not a lot of people are talking about Kyler Murray right now, in general. Like, he's not one of the more talked about players in the league. But he's still a beast. And he can still do stuff like that. I think I got one-on-one -on -one with Spears on a... That's a beam. Oh my gosh, good. Kyler? Good throw, Kyler. I'm looking for Higgins over the middle. I just don't know... I couldn't catch this with CD. It's the same kind of look. You know what? No. Good job, Wallace. From the red zone, here's the Heisman Trophy winner, Murray. Yep. I think he's at the, the two right there. Great little read. Good throw. Simple, simple, simple. I'm sketched out about that one. Tajay Spears, good cut. Okay. OKC, baby. OKC Blues, let's dance, let's dance, let's dance. Okay, defense, I honestly think what I need to do is I need to blitz Witherspoon off the edge. I need to get pressure on Mahomes and we can win this game. Get pressure on him, blitz every single play, make him make the crazy reads, and double Kelsey with my user. That's how I'm going to win this. Good play. Is he short? No, he got it. We really can't get pressure. We can't get anything on that. Go, get to him. Finally. I think, oh, who got to, I think it was Witherspoon. One of the two. I'm just sending. Like I said, I'm sending heat every single play. I'm going to back off my coverage. And I'm going to try and make somebody make a play out there. Literally cover zero. Check seams, check seams, check seams. Got him, Will Anderson. He's out, he's out of range, isn't he? 45 yard line. I'm just going to scream at you, bro. That's the identity of the Blues, man. That's the identity of the Blues. We are, when in doubt, I got Crosby, Anderson. We struggle against the run. We're going to struggle in some situations, but in those 100% pass situations, someone's going to get home for us. Go end it for me, Spears. Good run. Holy. Oh my gosh. End it, Spears. End it, Spears. Did he get that? Second and inches. GG's, fellas. Kyler Murray on his new team. He's back in Oklahoma and he's just loving life right now. GG's, bro. Big time dub. Ladies and gentlemen. Boom, fellas! Week two, going up against Mexico City. This guy said in the chat that he was literally could not. He lost every single bidding warrior, which makes it interesting because, like, the city that you're in, um, I know a lot of the guys are like London, a lot of those cities. The the overall like player interest to move there was lower. Um, so going up against Mexico City, this is a team that definitely, definitely, definitely is not as good as ours. Um, which is good. We're going to see that in this franchise. Like I said, it was literally everybody, every man for themselves. A lot of people, when you play the game, you win or your team sucks. And some people, their teams suck. We, I think, did a really freaking good job uh, because we played things safe. We don't have any, like, marquee insane superstars. We do have Devin Weatherspoon, who is an insane superstar. I absolutely love him. Um, Kyler Murray had a really good game. I love him. I scrambled around really well with him. Um, I felt comfortable, like I said, playing back in Oklahoma. That's like probably my favorite storyline of this entire thing. Um, okay, so Mexico City, we're at home again in Oklahoma um, at Blue Field. Toughen up our division. Snowhawks are 2-0. Um, we're 1-0. The Desperados are 1-1 and, and the Armadillos are 1-0. Guys, lock in. Let's go. These uniforms are so interesting. Oh, gosh. I actually really like these uniforms. They're loud, like I can hear them, which isn't always a good thing. Like they are incredibly loud, but they're beautiful. Like I like his uniforms a lot, especially the helmet. The detail on the helmets is cool. I think he's just gonna continue running the ball. No, someone get to him. Yep. Ladies and gentlemen, 
from the University of Ella freaking Bama. Future superstar, absolute beast. Will punch him in the face, Anderson. Soon to be the whole face of this franchise. He's going to look Olave. Yep, yeah, SWAT team. I'm just blitzing. Oh my gosh. Brett. Oh. That, I honestly, was it not Marlon Humphrey that was on him? Good throw. My gosh, that's a good read on fourth down. Devin. Oh my, yeah, lurked. Got him, coach! Let's go, man! Devin Bush! Let's go! I think he saw it was a linebacker and threw it. Tough toenails, bud. Good defense. Blues football. Throw that out route, I think. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Look at the arm motion. Look at the arm motion from Murray. I love that. Yeah, you can outrun him. That's the thing about Kyler. Too much. Too much. Sorry, Kyler. I love. Oh, that was too much. Too many juke moves. Just let it be a memory. Let it be a memory with a lot of sick jukes. Oh, goodness. That was almost horrendous. Yep. Easy money. Easy money. Yep. That's literally me. That's... It was me. It was me. Dude, there's no... Don't ask for a flag, dude. That's a Snuggie. Nice job, Adori. You got burnt, but you made up for it. Well done. Okay. There we go, T. Good job, Higgins. Very, very, very good stuff. I have this thing, and like, it's not treatable. But like it's called just like taking way too long sometimes and thinking you can scramble more than you can. That's literally what I have. Oh my gosh, let's go! Let's go! C D Lamb! Let's go, man! He looks good in a blues uniform. Oklahoma freaking city. Love it. 7-0. We're playing good defense. Let's just continue to play defense. Um, he struggled to move the ball. He struggled to have time. We're doing a lot of things right. Double down on it. Yep. Oh, first. Just barely. I thought there was a chance. I, th I felt like I was one block away from that being very, very, very good. Like, a huge game. Yep, you're gone, Spears. You should be. Shoot, shoot, shoot. He weirdly... Did a horrible job, but by doing a horrible job, he did a good job. That's that's the strangest thing about the play that just happened. That's on. That sucks for him. He literally just lurked me. He lurked me, and it's gonna be a touchdown. T Higgins fan club been in the fan club forever. He lurked me right there. I don't know if you guys saw. He clicked on that guy. Literally should have been a pick six. He was baiting that the entire time. Power to him. I apologize. Hashtag OKC. We're good. You and I said in intermission feels like we're set up for a good second half. Well, the other side scored. And now no. it's well, he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. Getting torched right now. They'll 
Fake the handoff. Now Smith. Looking left side, and he's got a man. Drives of the third quarter, one for each. That tells me that someone's defense... Go. Go, Ingram. Go, Ingram. Good throw. I feel like Trevor Lawrence right now. That's a beautiful throw right there. Good screen. Hey, Zeus. Hey, buddy. One sec. Hello. They snap it to Smith. They able to find the open. I'm very, very close on the verge of selling this. He lets it go deep for a lobby. Good job. Good job, Ben. Holy no, cat, 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 cat. Nope. I'm looking after my childhood cat. Zeus, you guys might remember him. You, I forgot that cats can jump. I literally forgot that cats can jump. I was not mentally prepared for that. Because I have all these cords. I totally forgot. He used to get in so much trouble in this office. He unplugged my cords like six times once. Got him. Fourth down. That was for sorry. I was so distracted by Zeus. Zeus is like I said, my old like. If you guys watch the videos years, if you've been around a long time, you know who Zeus is. Um, he's my parents' cat, and he's staying with us for a little bit. Um, good job, Spears. That was that was a huge stop. Shout out to Zeus, man. Shout out to it is like it's uh. Where is he? I don't know. I love dogs and cats. I love all, I'm a big animal person. I love all animals. Like, I am just a big, 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 an, I, I'm an animal lover. Through and through. Go. Tajay Spears, first down. This game shouldn't have been this close. We had a little distraction of a cat who I thought was going to unplug all my stuff. But we fought through that. I think we're going to come out on top. OKC. Okay, Let's kill 30 seconds. Okay, yeah, he, he was saving the time up to try and ice us. Okay, first big test of the season, kicking wise. Simple, just put it through the uprights. I think I got that perfectly. I'm pretty sure I got that perfect. Boom, fellas! Ugly game against Mexico City. That is one I gotta learn from. I gotta be better from, but I'm 2 0. Statistically, offensively, don't look at our offensive stats because you'll be like, meh. But look at our defensive stats. Witherspoon, one and a half sacks. Devin Bush, Will Anderson, two sacks. Max Crosby. Like, our defense was literally shut down. Offense was horrible. I got to figure out a way to get in rhythm with CeeDee Lamb um, and all these guys. But overall, we're 2-0. and Can't be mad. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I actually really like the Snowhawks. Like, Sa Sacramento Snowhawks? I think, I don't know if it snows that much in Sa Sacramento. I think I know that it doesn't snow that much in Sacramento. But, hey... The name's the name, and don't worry about the name. And it ma it rhymes with Sacramento. Well, it's the same letter. It doesn't rhyme with Sacramento. I'm not looking very intelligent right now, um, as it stands. Guys, week three, I'm surprised we have not got a Will Anderson breakout so far. I really like this team. Will Anderson, like I said, 21 years old. Every single draft from here on out, I'm taking this guy. He's literally unbelievable. Like, he gets the quarterback better than like most superstars that I have in these leagues. Like he's been ridiculous. Tajay Spears gets an upgrade as well. Um, he's another one that you guys should look out for, mainly because of change of direction. Change of direction is such an important stat in Madden. Um, this is my question for you guys, and I I know you guys play CFM also. What are the best like abilities for like defensive linemen and stuff? Like, I don't think these are them um, by by any means. I think edge threat. Elite, probably. I can't quite get. Um, inside stuff. Under pressure. And no outsiders. I think those are probably the best. But in your guys' opinion, what are the top kind of... Like, I don't like his abilities that much. I feel like he needs, like, double or nothing. Inside stuff. And under pressure. And pass committed. So that way, if I go... Goal line stuff is kind of an interesting one. I've never... Guess play adjustment. Oh, okay. 
What's goal line stuff? The little faster shed moves for a better chance of showing runs within five yards of the goal line. That I'm going to use because I hope that that will pay dividends. Guys, going up against the, what did I say? The Snowhawks? That's why, this is so freaking confusing. Um, they got Herbert, ETN, Devontae Adams, weak at receiver, superstar Gerald Everett, Greg Rousseau, Josh Uche, Alex Highsmith, Patrick Sertan, and JC Horn. Really good DBs. Justin Simmons. Like, the defense is insane. The offense is not that great. He went all in on defense. <sighs> Let's go. Go. Go, Spears. Go, Spears. Get out of there. Get out of there, Tajay. There it is. Hey, run the ball. Our offense, our passing game last game didn't look great, but Spears did. And Spears is one of those players that we can hopefully, like, kind of grow this team around another good run from Spears because... He is so, like, his change of direction is good. He's young. He does a lot of things really well. He's fast. He's quick. He can juke. He can be the type of guy who's going to carry us um, come playoff time. So I definitely need to keep Spears happy. And this guy's defense is a little bit insane. Oh. Yep. Go Spears. Go Spears. Heads up. This defense is absolutely stupid. Yeah, I think I got him. I think I got him. CD Lamb Laser. There it is. Well done, CD. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Just run the ball. Tajay Spears. Okay. The most difficult thing about this is 100% the defense. So once we score, I don't think his offense is better than my defense. He does have Herbert. He does have a good tight end. I don't think his offense is that great. So to me, advantage me. As soon as I put points on the board, I think my defense can get him off the field. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm just overconfident, but I truly believe that. Go. Dangerous games with money in the pocket, fellas. That's a dangerous throw. Shoot. Got him. Devin Weatherspoon. He is literally on fire. I think that's like six sacks for him. I Maybe I'm being dramatic, but he's got a lot. He's been great. I'm going to switch the defense to cover three. Wow. Good catch. Justin Herbert looking to pass. It's verticals. Oh. Miss by Herbert. Oh, bro. That was a huge miss from Herbert. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to blitz the league. I'm just going to blitz the league and put him in the very hook. Got him. Give me those. Get lurked, bud. Oh, my gosh. That was one of that was on the top three lurks of the year for me. I think I don't, that is a... That was a prize lurk. That was good. Very good. Okay. CD Lamb? Yes, sir. Best on best. His superstar versus mine. Best on best. Yep. Go, Palmer. Go, Palmer. Juke. Juke. Don't fumble, Palmer. There it is. To throw is Murray. Laser, yep, and the foul. Shoot him one free throw. Shoo. Two, Shoo. three. Shoo. Evan Ingram, love him. Yep, Ryan Neal, dude, have a day, Ryan Neal. Do I do I play it safe or do I go for the T Higgins like just punch him in the face play? Oh, I play it safe, don't I? I think I play it safe. I'm just going to try and get like 10, 15 yards here. Ready, ready, ready. Boom. Got him. There it is. Time out. One second left. Thank you. Field goal unit. Guys, this was a huge bounce back game. I guess, honestly, a bit better of an opponent. Um, good bounce back. Uh, just a good half. We played good defense. Our offense, I wasn't forcing it. We got blitzed a lot, and I made the right reads, not the wrong reads. We're figuring it out. OKC. 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 Got him. Look out. 
Blood count. I think T. Higgins just won. I think T. Higgins won. Oh, he's got to get those. At some point, I need T. Higgins to play like... Like, I want vintage last season T. Higgins. That's the T. Higgins that I want. I want the new Kanye, bro. I want the old school My Franchise T. Higgins. That guy... I love that. That guy was the best receiver ever. Now he's like, they don't have him as good. T. Higgins, man. Oh, just once, T. Higgins. Just once. I just want you to moss somebody. Like, I want to end the game right here. This is just like a division thing for me. Whenever I'm playing in the division, I'm just like, you know what? I just want to end the game. I'm going to be disrespectful. I'm going to do some questionable things just to try and end the game. That's exactly how I feel right now. If it, if it pays off, it pays off. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But this time, I think it's going to pay. Good hit, Spears. Okay, play defense. That's all right. Oh, no. Dory. Dory. That sucks, Dave. Now I gotta be smart. That's on me. Yeah, there it is. Better. Better, better, better. Better, better, better. Okay, I'm gonna run the clock out. I don't want this to be a game. I got a little bit disrespectful. Now we run the ball. Yeah, this is... I'm worried about game two. This is not it. I'm moderately worried about game two. But that that guy is the only reason I'm not worried is because of CD freaking Lamb. GG's guys. Okay. Bit of a weird game. Honestly, it was one in the first half. Um, he eventually started to box me up, which is definitely, if you were to look at this from like a long-term standpoint, I think that would be my biggest concern. CD was unbelievable. The defense, once again, stepped up. Um, Witherspoon had two sacks. Williams, Grover, Stewart, everyone, Will Anderson had nothing this game, but Witherspoon's going to lead the NFL in sacks. He is just so good at that. Um, we won that game in the first half. We lost it in the second half. I would say I was outplayed probably in the third and the fourth quarter, and I, as I was just trying to run the clock. I should have made some much more intelligent decisions. I didn't. It is what it is. You live and you learn. You crash and you burn. But at the end of the day, you just got to learn. Week three, big time dub. Love it. We're 3-0. We get the Armadillos next week, um, which is also going to be a tough game. Lock in like Stockton, dude. Find a way. Um, statistically, we're kind of like good in a lot of ways. We're, we're like not offensively. This is where we're good. This is where we're good. Right here. Defensively. We draft. We, and that's all my first picks for defense. So offense, we're kind of just getting by. But Spears is averaging 5.7, which is awesome. CeeDee Lamb's doing good. No production out of T. Higgins. Like, look at this. These are T. Higgins stats. That is not right. That is bad. That is very, very, very bad. And I think that is, that's got to be at the core of like, oh my gosh, what am I doing so wrong? Because there's no way that dude should have those stats. Okay. We got staff points to spend. We'll see you guys week number four. Um, current NFL leaders. Let's go see who the, there's one team in here that's literally stupid. Um, the Monarchs are crazy. A lot of these teams are the Sentinels from Rio de Janeiro. There's two Rio de Janeiro teams, and they're both undefeated. The Black Knights, the Blues, the Caps, the Pioneers, um, and the Lumberjacks. Guys, we'll see you guys all week three. Ladies and gentlemen, my hair is so poofy. I want to just grow it out, man. Oh, gosh. My hair just bugs me. Like, I look, you ever look at yourself and just sort of like, you know... What is up with my hair? I, I'm not like, I, I don't really care. I just hate when my hair is poofy. It's just like, I hate when it's just like, can anyone relate to this? It's like, when it's got that like just poof of just like, ugh, it's just poofy. I feel like it's just, brr, bugs me. Um, we're three and no, going up against Australia? Oz, is this freaking Australia? Oh my gosh, this is the coolest league ever. Armadillos, okay, they have Jonathan Allen, Trey White, DK Metcalf, Tyron Matthew, Aaron Rodgers. Okay, this is a good squad also. Um, where are they from? Where the heck are the Armadillos from? This is hilarious to me. 
But they are like literally what? Armadillos. Aust oh Austin. I was like, dude, are we in Australia right now? Um, I have 190 staff points. I have a QB1 check-in. So Kyler Murray, in order to get this team to where I want this team to be, I would love if Kyler Murray could potentially get breakouts. I'm going to try and go for 300 yards in this game. Him and Willie Anderson are my two that are like, boom, I need breakouts with you guys. We're 3-0, blue field. <sighs> Let's go. I love when people accept the delay of game penalty. Like, just so classy. So classy. Except the delay, T. Higgins will make you pay. That's that's how I'm looking at this. As soon as you accept that delay on me, I'm no longer nice. I'm no longer T.D. Barrett. I am T.D. Hate it. And I am literally out to make your two games completely miserable. I promise you, you will never beat me. You accept that delay, I am angry, and I'm going to make you pay for it. You are you have every right to do it. I'm, I, I am not actually mad at the... The core of doing it. Oh my gosh, that was almost a snuggie. Okay, I gotta relax. I'm fired up. Come on, CD Lamb, Mr. MVP, King of Oklahoma. Where did CD Lamb? Wait a minute. Where does CD Lamb go to school? Comments. See if you can beat me. See if you know before I do. He was Oklahoma. Dude, what? I literally unintentionally just did the... I, I brought two Oklahoma City legends back to Oklahoma without even having a clue. Kyler Murray, I low-key knew. Oh my gosh, I am the coolest for that. Good for me. Good for me on that one. Go. I, I don't normally fix that. Fix that. Oh! Good job, defense. There it is, man. This hat just doesn't work. Let's just own it. Let's throw it. I don't know, man. You got to look at my hair. I apologize. I actually am legitimately sorry that you have to look at my hair right now. That's on me. Stupid. Just given everything that's going on, we're in no position to take stupid risks. Kyler, that's why I love you, man. Good throw on the run. Get my get. <coughs> Holy moly, Brett. Ingram. CD Lamb, Mr. Oklahoma. Mr. Oklahoma to Mr. Oklahoma. At some point, I really want to throw it to Higgins, but I just don't know if it's the move right now. There it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Good job, Kyler. Kyler. Dude. Brett, just literally. Okay, find a way. Oh, brother, man. That was... Mm, okay. I don't think his offense is ne anything special. Just based on what I saw, he's going to juke in. Just play the juke. We got to be just... Defense has to show up. He gets ball at half, too. We're, we're low-key kind of cooked. Good play call. No, no hurt on that one. That actually got perfectly over the zone. I should have blitzed. I kind of second guessed myself a little bit, and I decided not to blitz. I made two careless reads. Like at the end of the day, you don't win making reads like that. Two very, very, very careless reads. That's not good. Hmm. 
I am a lot of the reason for our mistakes. I feel like we've had two good drives and two horrible ends to those drives. So at the end of the day, like it's all me. It's nobody but me. CD Lamb, dude. Just throw him. Can we throw him the ball like every play? The animations this guy gets is disgustingly good. Okay, lock in, Brett. Get seven, get a stop. Get seven, get a stop. Yeah, you're good. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Now slide. You don't have to use a timeout here, just quick snap verticals. It'll only be about 10 seconds. Use a timeout if I don't get something here, but I, I do want to try and hurry this up. Spears cares, man. Spears freaking cares. Do I take three here or do I play it? Bucket Hat Barrett, baby. Bucket Hat Barrett. Let's go. That's a Snuggie. That's a Snuggie. No way. I just allowed that. He's short, but hopefully that's short enough where he, he's going to go for it. Bro, what? What is Witherspoon doing? I literally put him in a hard flat. What is he doing? Oh my gosh. If you want to watch football, get Game Pass. Like, that's horrible. You can't run. Good defense. Got him. Got him. Got him. And take the ball. Take the ball. Take the ball. Come on. Now we got to go score quick. CD Lamb. Let's go score as soon as possible. I want him with the ball back. That's a bad kick. Dude, the amount of people who have punters because they can't. You literally. I don't understand how people make that mistake. Like, check your kicker, dude. I don't understand that. Now. Hey, this 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 could all just be like that's that's Madden. When when you accept someone's delay a game, Madden's like, yo, you know what? Enjoy this punter at kicker, bud. Throwing on first down is Murray. That's a good play. You think I'd have CD Lamb here though? Like, I just don't see how I wouldn't. I just don't see how I wouldn't. CD's just different. CD, bro. CD. We're going on a road trip. Bring CD, man. 14 up. Okay, now we play defense. I think I can just blitz the league on the dude. I don't think he's... And just use our Metcalf. That's all I gotta do. Kind of fake chase him. Guys, what I say... Mad Max! Fury freaking road! Mad Max just dummied him. Oh my gosh, he just dummied him. Hey, I'm not I'm not stupid, dude. You, you're gonna not play flats? I know you're shook. In this case though, they're not gonna feel so great about it. CD Lamb. That's field goal range. Simple, bro. Couple dots, man. Couple dots. Never hurt anybody. Shoot. Mm, you go for the win, though. Like this. This is legitimately the win. That's on me. That's the one of the worst play calls I've ever made. That's literally might be the worst play call. He only has one timeout. OT it is, fellas. What a game. A way more difficult game than it needed to be.
Witherspoon. Oh. I deserve to lose. We're just going to forget about it. I played really stupid. It won't affect the season. We'll beat them next time. I don't know why I went for that. That's just absolutely ridiculous. I don't know why on earth I went for that. Why on earth did I go for that? Like, I just can't even mentally get into my own headspace of what would make me... What, what would make me go for it in that situation on fourth down... Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Okay, uh, we'll do better next week. I still am optimistic. Horrible. Like, D-line was still good. I honestly just shot myself in the foot. And it won't happen again. I learned my lesson. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. San Juan Nighthawks. I will not make any more mistakes during this franchise. I literally, sometimes I look smart. Sometimes I look so dumb. Right there, I look so dumb. And I, I honestly, I'm pretty angry about it. But... It won't happen again. I get a redemption game against that guy in a couple weeks. It's not even going to be close, I promise. I just don't know what was... I wanted to end the game rather than giving him a minute to get in field goal range. But in reality, I should have just taken the three. He had one time out and played defense. Let him go... We still ended up in OT. Um, we just couldn't clutch up in OT. Going up against Lawrence Gary, a 1-3 in three squad here. Um, I think overall, the running game needs to be more of a priority on this team. Um, T Higgins needs to, I just, I think in a lot of ways I'm missing things and I think I don't like that. I think I'm missing reads and I'm underutilizing a lot of my players that I really love like T Higgins. And that to me is not okay. Um, we got to lock in like Stockton here, fellas, do our thing. Let's go. Yikes, dude. Yikes, man. Holy Brett. That sucked. Play action. Now it's Murray. T yo, that's not T. Higgins. That's called that's literally C D Lamb, Brett. Wake up, bud. Wake up. Good throws though. From the red zone. Here's the Heisman Trophy winner, Murray. Oh, Kyler. I think he's just honestly in man. I think he's just in man coverage. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I've been told. Oh no. Oh no. They still can't get it. Heads up. Heads up, Brett. Tajay Spears got him. Holy moly. Okay. Breathe, everybody breathe. Hey, no man. That was That was horrible. That was not a good read, but I'll take it. 7-0. Let's get out of San Juan with a win. I, I want the Armadillos. I want to play. I, I forget all these names, dude. Half, I don't even know who the heck I'm playing anymore, but I just, I want the Armadillos. Ah, uh, good play. Jacoby Myers. Dory, Dory. Dory literally almost just got completely burned. He found him. He found Dory right there. That was... He had him off the first step, 100%. Yo, one day I might have kids, Chris Godwin, and they're going to have to watch this game. That was disgusting. That was disrespect. That was absolutely unreal, though. Good play. Good play. Okay, we get the ball. Dang, man. I love all these new stadiums, though. This is sick. I just am not buzzing like I need to be, like... But I gotta think, I was very close to being 4-0. I was one really dumb mistake from being 4-0. So, keep that confidence. There it is! There it is! Good job, Ingram! 
Like this this game, for example, eight for nine passing for a stupid amount of yards. Like this is a very, very, very good game. What's the, I think that's gotta be on him, right? That's gotta go that should go that way. Yeah, illegal contact. Uh I'll take the first. Back to the air on second down, it's Murray. Yep, go. Slide, slide the glide Drexler. Okay, 46 seconds. Kyler Murray, they're trying to they're trying to keep us down, Kyler. T. Higgins, at what point am I gonna throw a dot to you, man? I know I got that. You just gotta make the throw. Blues football. I want breakouts with Kyler, man. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. I want a breakout with Kyler Murray. Something's got to give here, dude. Something's got to give. That's way short. I don't know how Evan Ingram didn't catch that last ball. I really hope you show that, Nick. Bro. 10-7. Yeah, I, I read that like a book. I read that like a book. Go. Let's go, man. Saw it from a mile away. Freaking blues, dude. What's Oklahoma City known for? What's it known for? I don't even care. That's, oh my gosh, let's go. That's beautiful. Okay. Love that. Love that, love that, love that. 17-7. That changes everything. Literally get lurked, kid. Good stuff. Got him. Nice, nice, Anderson. Yeah, you flex after that, dude. You couldn't catch a freaking cold. Oh my gosh, how do you flex after that? Like, what are you flexing? Oh, I can't catch, flex. That's not a flex. You don't flex after doing something horrible. Like, you flex there, Benjamin St. Just. You make a beautiful play, flex. Flex on him, please. Have at her, flex, everybody. But don't flex after that. Sorry, I'm, I'm weird right now, I don't know. I'm just, I'm still mad. Oh, now I'm stuck on my... Whole squad's gotta just sit up. We need an OKC anthem, bro. We need an OKC anthem. That's my guy right there. Oklahoma, all the way from Tulsa to Tulsa to Oklahoma City. Tulsa's in Oklahoma, right? Oh God. I'm not American, can't get mad at me. Receivers tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big Ben St. Just. GG's man, get me out of here. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we had a force win against now we're back playing against Austin, Texas. The Austin, Texas Armadillos. A game where I feel so cheated in. Literally, we gotta step up. I gotta start playing smarter. I feel like my IQ is moving at two right now. It's got to get up to 10. Like it's, it's very, every, my processing speeds are like a, a baseline model Dell laptop is my processing speeds. Like I'll probably be able to watch Netflix, but like don't try and open up Facebook in the same browser. That's my processing speed in my head right now. It's just not there. I don't know what's wrong. Some days you just feel like you have, I'm, but the good thing is I'm five and one, so I don't suck. And a lot of these teams are really good defensively, so we can't expect. Tajay Spears, I want to get him a superstar depth. That's part of the goal of this entire thing. Find a way to get Tajay Spears superstar. Um, if I can pull that, uh, that off, I think it'd be big. This game is just like more of an ego thing for me. The last game that I played him, I didn't think he was that good. I wasn't that impressed by him, so I was like really upset when I lost, like to the point where I like, I took a moment, I lost it a little bit, but it is what it is. We find a way. Players are ready to negotiate, we gotta talk some contracts. We have a lot of these guys locked up super long term. Mad Max Crosby's been really good. A lot of these guys have been really good. And that's like the thing I have to remember as I like, ideally don't get super negative about things because I, I wanna make sure that I stay 
positive. I think I can win a Super Bowl with this team. I, I, I truly do. So at the end of the day, it comes down to how do I get better? How do I make T. Higgins T. Higgins again? Like, T. Higgins was my favorite receiver of all time. And right now he looks like freaking, I don't even know. Like, I haven't done anything with T. Higgins. I have nothing. I couldn't have done less with T. Higgins. I'm struggling with Kyler. Every it's We're a hot mess express. But it's week seven. Redemption is a dish best served with a side of redemption. Going up Armadillo Field. We're going to his house, Austin, Texas. Let's go. What? Turks? Turk? Who the heck is... Why is Turk the GOAT? I think what he did, low-key what I think he did, is I think he was double-teaming everyone except Turk. And Turk just said, yeah, I don't, I don't deal with that level of disrespect on a day-to-day -day basis. And I respect the heck out of Turk for saying that to him. Yeah, bro, that's a hard flat. And how, Marlon, are you going to call yourself elite? I'm on that. Should be short. Should be short. Take the ball from him, please. I look like John Lovett. That looked like John Lovett. Oh, brother. Okay, offense. Be great. Dunk on him. That is like, that is the purpose of why I, I got T. Higgins right there. Finally, we, I think we all got to witness it. So I can just throw bad read high balls to him. Yep. Nice throw. Get juked, kid. Get juked, kid. Vintage Kyler Murray. Love to see it. 7 up. Come here. That's fourth. I know I can stop him. I know I can stop Aaron. He's going to go for this here. And if, if he does and we get him off the field, we get ball at half. So, like, everything slides in this game in our favor if we can somehow get him off the field here. Bagged. Okay. Be smart. Take some time off the clock here. There it is. Thing is, he has three timeouts now and I'm out of bounds, meaning he does get the ball back with minimum, like, probably 50 seconds on the clock if he wants it. Wish I probably could have played that a little bit different, but you live and you learn, you crash and you burn. And yeah. Honestly, just trying to kill clock. I got nobody open. And I think I'm more comfortable trying to score from the 13. I've My red zone's been horrible, so. I'm just going to try and quick snap something here. Yep, got him. See what I mean? I'd rather, as crazy as that sounded, sometimes I look smart. Last time I played this guy, I looked really dumb. I would rather call a play from the 13 because zones, they're just like, they're going to play different stuff's going to get over. In, when it's close like that, Nothing's open. Beautiful drive. 14 7. Murray gonna throw. I honestly was gonna throw that, but I feel like something better. I think Just I can I think I can scramble. Scramble with, with zero percent chance of like a weird and accurate, especially in a game like this. Divisional game that I can't afford to lose. That's what I'm gonna do. Go, go Spears, go Spears. Yeah, one block. Great blocking. Superstar alert. Honestly, the most unsung hero of Oklahoma, Tajay Spears. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. 21-7. 
Oh my gosh. Mom, I just hit a clip. It's not sweet, man. I might just use her blitz against this guy every time. You know what? This time, though, let me put him on him. He's going to try and throw to him. I'm just going to send one guy off the edge. He's going to think the fullback's going to be open because he thinks it's sweet out here, but it's not. Bagged. Okay. One touchdown. GG's. We're right back at it. I told you guys I would beat this guy the next time. Oh, oh my, that is what we paid for. We're starting to buzz. We're starting to buzz. Nope, Tajay's. That was gross. Good job, Spears. GG's, bro. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that was what we do. That was what we do. Now, this guy's one and this guy got Lamar. His team's sick. And you got one win? Bruh. That ain't good. Um, but he has Lamar Jackson. I was worried when I saw this Salt Lake team. It's a stacked offense with no defense, though. And I, I think I showed them at the beginning. Quinnen's been a beast. We just blitz. We blitz people every single play. We blitz people twice sometimes. I never, I don't give him play. We blitz until we don't know who we are anymore. Um, couple good games for Kyler in a row. He's actually starting to run around really well. 11 touchdowns, 6 interceptions. Spears has probably been the best overall player just given like a lot of yards on both i throw my running back a good amount now and then our whole defense five and a half four and a half three chad turk three quinnon williams two and a half minka two like everyone on this team is getting the quarterback we we're just a super aggressive team in oklahoma city um we got lamar jackson we get to play this guy twice hopefully we can lock in get a dub and just continue i want to take over this division the snowhawks have only lost to us and we got to play him again so week eight be great Run, 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 run. It's all right. Good play. Uh oh. And the feet down. He's not the fastest, but like if I throw a ball in somewhat of a contested area, that's who I want trying to catch it, is what I'm saying. Like he's not the fastest guy in the world. But he has proven on many occasions. Love that. Love that so much. I love that. Mm, that's tough. That's tough. That's tough. That's tough. Just out here a moment ago through the pick six, so we'll see if they can take better care of the That's a dot. Nice catch, Ingram. Okay, against a player that you don't think is much better than you, you are best off literally coming out and trying to just score as fast as... I think I have Palmer. Whoosh. Come on. Got him. Haven't done a lot of that this season, but Kyler's got the arm strength to do it. If you think you're better than somebody, you don't run the ball, you just go score. You just get the game moving, prolong the game, you'll thank yourself. 7 up. Nuggy. Like, who? What? Where? Freaking Judy, what? How do you catch that? Yo, cut on a dime. That should be a crime. Good play. Shoot. Shoot. Okay, need points. Yeah. Good job, CD. I got three timeouts. I'm going to use one of them. He burnt him, like, off the line. He, he burnt him completely. By the time, yep. Yeah. I like that. Ah, uh, you gotta get out though. Red zone has been such a dead zone. Red zone has been such a dead zone. Mm. Make somebody miss. Make somebody miss. Make somebody miss. Clutch season, bro. Clutch season. Okay. 
Defense, we gotta hold them for four, 16 seconds, and then halftime comes around. Let's amp this up. Oh my gosh, give me the three. No, go to bounce, go to bounce. Jamar is gonna get you going to bounce. Take the, take the free three points. Get lurked. I thought if I had I kept running, I'm not getting points out of this. At some point, you gotta play smart. I think I'm the better player. Take three. That's a dub. Yep, got him. Okay, lurks. It's about time I start. Like I, I went this entire season without. I hate when my controller does this. Um. Without really utilizing, I spent a lot of money on Minka. So to see him, to see me start getting lurks again is a beautiful sight to see. And we, we just got to score with, because our red zone is so bad. I think my red zone's just got to be literally handing this guy the ball. Yeah. Did you eat at work? Uh, if you have something. What about the, are we doing the Bulgur Bowl? On rice? Okay. Good job. Good job, Williams. What? Throwing now is Murray. And he will slide to clutch. And we can take the two minute warning. That is clutch, man. Minimum, I can take the clock down or take his timeouts and get three. But I'm a couple first downs away from winning it. That's a first. That actually might be the game right there. The, the inches, I think that might just be the game right there. He's only got two timeouts. Plus, I got this. I think we just won. Guys, GG's in the chat. That was a hard fought team win. Like, those, these are the type of games, though, you got to win. If you're going to win the entire thing, you can't be losing to one in five squads. You got to find ways to win, find ways to get stops. And Tajay Spears has done that for us this entire season. I think I can just run this out. Yeah, GG's. Don't fumble for six. GG's, guys. Oh, big time dubs, man. Starting to figure it out. The defensive line's killing it. Kyler Murray's starting to play ball. We're winning ugly, but we're winning. Oklahoma City, baby. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, time to play Montreal. Um, I don't know what happened. I don't know if he missed the sign. I'm not even going to pretend like I... This team's horrible. If I lose this game, I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm going to do if I lose this game. Um, but I'm not going to lose this game. Evan Ingram gets an upgrade shot to Evan Ingram. He's going to go up to a true 88 overall. 88 be great. Still, my hair is still bad. Update um, has not changed over the last... Maybe I'll get a haircut tonight. Um, but at the end of the day, week nine... This division's got to be mine, bro. The division's got to be mine. Let's go. Yeah, that's fun. That's good. I like that. Look at him. I like that. Nice. Kick return for touchdown. Easy start to the game. Now I'm going to go for the onset. I'm going to try and make this quick. No! <sighs> I'm trying to take the ball. I don't know if he's unconcerned. Good plays by him, though. He's moving it actually really well. I just need, if I use her, that guy, I think he's cooked. Got him. Give me those. Will Anderson. Dude! This guy's got a resume longer than a freaking 
university principal. How many, like, wow. I love him. I really love him. Tough toenails, bud. Tough freaking toenails. Oh my, this isn't even, this is kind of what it was going to be. This is kind of what I think we all kind of expected this might be. Yeah, T. Higgins. T. Higgins. Yes, sir. Good throw, Kyler. Big body receiver. Can we let's can I just get to the point where I can just throw it to him? Throwing on first down is Murray. Yeah, you're in the end zone. You should be. You should be. Well done, Kyler. We're buzzing. We're buzzing now. We're buzzing now. Go up to Higgins. Back shoulder fade for the kids at home. Dude, every time I throw to the dude, it's just a pick. Like, I, I don't know, man. T. Higgins isn't what he used to be. I'm not even blaming him, the virtual him. I love the real him is my favorite player. I'm just saying, for whatever reason, in this game, when I throw it up to him, it's just literally an interception every single time. And it's starting to make me a little bit mad. Yeah, we got to just chill out a little bit on the blitz. They threw the inners really well, and they're awfully confident right now. To me, it's time to attack and take some of that momentum back. But make sure you're selected. Lance looking to throw it. Here's Lance. Okay. Did you play here? Back to throw now on first down. Evan Ingram, laser. Okay, slow it down. I think. I think despite I think I get ball at half. So no, I don't. I got a kick return. I literally haven't moved. He has been unbelievable on defense. I actually need to score here. Spears, we don't deserve you, bro. Spears, I don't even know how you caught that. That was an absolute Ian book that I just threw. That was an absolute Ian book. And you somehow just caught that ball. No idea how. Yeah, I'm done. I was about to say, I'm done going to freaking Higgins. I'm going to start throwing at him. Good. Oof. Okay, take three. I don't know, man. I'm just gonna try and get out of here with the win. I don't even. We we can't move, so you gotta miss this a little last. Fourth down. He might take three here. To throw for it on Come here. Got him. Thank you, Quinn Williams. Okay, get seven. Literally run the ball. This game's over. Get me out of Montreal. I love Montreal. I'm Canadian. But get me out of Montreal, please. Oh, my gosh. Higgins, thank you. That is the T. Higgins I love. Slide, Kyler. Touchdown ends it. Just throw, throw a wheel to Spears. I don't think he's going to guard. I not think to guard that. He's not. Spears, you make one guy miss. Love you. GG's. Oh, my gosh. Take us to the bye week. GG's. Plays out. Boom, fellas. Haircut. Pop up with the cut. With the chopper. Who's the owner? I think it's a... Ah, what song is that? I love that. Guys, haircut. Haircut. Feels so good. So good, man. So freaking good. Okay, we had the bye week, and then literally three people who the last guy usually is around. He's not around. Unfortunately, like I said, sometimes because these leagues move so fast, I'm trying to post these every single two days. If people people have jobs, people have lives, I totally get it. Um, we do miss some weeks. I do my very best. So I apologize if you hate me, if you don't want to watch it anymore. I understand, but I'm trying to get I can't force these people to play. But we do have another rematch against, we have a lot of big games against a lot of teams with really good records coming up. And we're playing good football. Devin Weatherspoon, you already know what it is. 
Um, plus one acceleration, plus two tackle. Dude's an absolute stud. Will Anderson Jr. is going to get an upgrade. He's going to go plus one speed rush. He's up to a 90 overall. I would love a breakout with him before the playoffs because him on that side with like, oh my gosh, it would just be disgusting. I am considering maybe moving Mad Max because inside stuff seems to be a little bit better on the one side. I don't know. You could definitely argue it which side to put that on, but Kyler Murray is going to get an upgrade as well. Holy schmoly doly. Um, as I said, rematch against the Snowhawks. They are a completely offensive built team. No, they're a defensive built team. We are a team that I think is quite balanced. Um, they have a good record. We have a good record. We have a big game next week against a team with a pretty good record also. So um, this time we're at Bluefield. We're, we're at our house. I'll give you guys kind of a stat update and a league update um, to show you just how the whole league's going. 21 and 10 for Kyler Murray. But I think what I should do is I should go show you guys all the stats from the entire league. I think that would be kind of neat. Dak Prescott. Bro, what? Mahomes, bro, Bryce Young on the Shamrocks, Brock Purdy. Those are your kind of top QBs. Rushing numbers, CMC 13, Saquon. There's a lot of thousand yard rushers. Receiving numbers, Cup, Diggs, Adams, Olave. You're kind of just seeing the normal. Um, sack number 16 for Parsons. Look at the, that team. You want to play that team? You want to play them? I don't. I'll tell you one thing I don't. Okay. Second divisional game against our biggest divisional rival here. Um, we got to lock in. Kyler, we got to be great. We got to throw good routes. Let's go. Oh, okay, let's dance, fellas. Tajay Spears, everybody, clutch up and be great today, man. Clutch up and be great. Another another win here would give us a good chance. Like I said, our schedule coming up is very challenging. Um, we play a lot of good players back to back to back, sort of. So this game is just crucial that we can find a way to win. Go Ingram. Good job. I see you, dude. I see you. I see you. I see you. I'm thinking T. Higgins will be open here. T. Higgins is good after the catch, too. That's what I'm saying. That's another, like, another way to utilize T. Higgins is just, like, throwing it to him on. I feel like a lot of times I think of, like, T. Higgins is someone that I have to be throwing the ball deep to all the time in order to make it worth it. But in reality, I just don't know if that's the case. I think it's actually more beneficial to throw it to him short. Let him let him break tackles is something that he's also really good on. Job. Good job. Spears. Yep. CD. Leah, Mr. Oklahoma, man. Swim. Go swim. Go swim. Good job. Okay. Jacob check around the first and ten at Spears. Here on third down. From the gun on third down. Thank you. Okla freaking Homa. Stop blitzing me. Everybody stop blitzing me so much. 7 0 and like I said, his Achilles heel. His Achilles heel is the fact that I don't think his offense is that great. That's his Achilles heel. Right, what are we doing? What are we doing? Oh, that's horrible. Come on, Witherspoon! Devin Witherspoon! Oh my gosh! Dude! That was Devontae that he just put into an absolute snuggie. That was Devontae. Okay. I'm just going to throw that. I think I think this is just all out blitz. Yeah, day late and a dollar short, bud. Day late and a dollar short. Tough toenails. To throw, it's Murray. Able to hit his target lane. Stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone. Got him. CD Lamb again. We got 129 left here. Mm, okay. This, like I said, these are huge games for the division. So, it's a hut. Throwing 
Yep, sucks to suck, bud. Sucks to suck. His user went immediately with Evan Ingram. I was like, when people blitz me, I just run verticals. Verticals is really hard to stop. When people are playing like that, just like that wild style of reckless football, verticals is what you do 100% of the time because that's the only play where I know I'm going to have someone potentially open in like two seconds. It's really hard for his user to guard all three of those guys. Beautiful freaking stuff. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. Dude, that could have literally... Not that it wasn't ice. Potentially, like it's... We're up 14, but... I always look at those and I'm trying to think of what set of moves. Like, should I have went spin maybe? Instead of like, what set of moves would have helped me more there? Shoot. Nope. One thing I do, like my worst trait, is I play the juke. And then when I play the juke sometimes, I end up... Yeah, things go horribly. And then that, getting stuck on my line. Like, I just so quick... How quickly a game, I'm overconfident. I forget about the running back, and all of a sudden we have a game again. Okay, Kyler... Oh, brother, what am I doing? Got him. Oh, my gosh. Ryan Neal, you have literally been the best player on defense. And nobody other than me... Knows it. Well, and probably if you guys are watching right now. Some people, a couple thousand people will know it too. 21-7, nice. That's got to be it. I honestly, the, his offense, he's got the QB, he has everything. He's just, his receivers aren't good. I can tell you he's running stuff that don't necessarily normally... Um, see people do but he's trying i i think his achilles heel and i hope i hope i hope i hope in the playoffs we see it all come true i think his achilles heel is that his defense or his offense is way worse than his defense and i think i think i can win with this team i'm gonna go to cd and try and end this thing yeah that's that's ggs ggs in the chat fellas Moving on, let's go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, time, we're going to Melbourne. Long flight to Australia to face young Desmond in a very young team with a really good offensive line. Their overall is one of the best things. I don't think their team looks that good, but the overall of this team is just silly. Um, 84 overall, 87 defense, but they're all just like really good linemen um, all over, which is what makes them really tough. Will Anderson gets seven guys. The biggest disappointment of this season, bar none, I think um, it's just like the fact that I haven't got a single breakout yet. I think I like, I don't know. I thought Spears, maybe Kyler, like I hope this ends in a bowl because I, you can't obviously predict. There's some seasons where I get like six breakouts or seven breakouts and everything's good and dandy and it's all perfect. And then there's some franchises where it's like, bro, this sucks. Like we cannot get anything. And that's, that's kind of how this one is um, a little bit. I just feel like we can't get a breakout to save our lives. And it's, it's driving me a little bit crazy. This Melbourne team, I think, is good. We got three tough games to end, week 16, week 17, and 18. This Melbourne team's good. Don't get me wrong. But definitely beatable. We're 13-1. and one. I believe if the season ended right now, we would be the number one seed. So let's keep that up, man. Uh, I haven't gotten a number one seed in a while. So I got three wins to get the number one seed. Let's go. Yep. Nice. I love the way Kyler throws the ball. Like that's, I think they, yeah, they say he's got one of the best like spirals in the NFL too. And I, I completely believe it. Bro, I'm going up again. 
Evan Ingram, three straight throws to Evan Ingram. Let's go to the run game. As much as I want to... Oh, bro, I want a Kyler breakout so bad. Okay, I think I have Higgins, unless he's trying to lurk me into this. Oh, he kind of was. Call him freaking Judy Hops from Zootopia. Oh, my gosh. Dude, oh, my gosh, he declared him. If that's not the biggest hit you've ever seen. Oh my gosh. Holy moly. Oh no, 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 does this take me to the 25? So dumb. Yep, go. Six for six. We're starting to like, I'm starting, things are starting to click a little bit. That's ridiculous. That's a one-handed pick. That was freaking gorgeous. Quinnen! Quinnen with help from Anderson! That This is very helpful, guys. Okay, um... I'm just gonna use her commit. I have no idea what Ritter just did. Ritter, that was really bad by Ritter. Really bad. Let's go, Higgins. That's a new kind of, that motion out actually. That motion out works pretty good. Just on that play, if I motion him out, I can throw it against cover two. Only if they're backed off though. Got him. Good job, Kyler. Murray gonna throw. Come on, Murray. Come on, Murray. Three is fine here, though. Like, I have to... I have to accept the fact that three here puts me in a relatively decent spot, still. That's my... That's Kyler, bro! Good job, Kyler. First down. And now Murray's gonna set up the throw. CD Lamb! No, oh, oh. And, uh, was it a good read? Nope. Was it a bad read? Yep. Was it a touchdown? Yep. Am I proud of it? Nope. 7-0? 14-0? Yep, thank you, CD Lamb. That sucks. Good tackle, Witherspoon. What are we doing, man? Okay, play offense. I think I literally maybe did I have Ingram? I just don't trust any I think I can just dot this guy. I think I had Ingram wide open. I probably just completely missed him. Now they'll audible to something else. Go, go Higgins! Hit a clip, Higgins. Oh, do I take, I feel, oh no, you know what? Hmm, I don't think I take three here. I don't. Is he blitzing us like crazy though still? Yeah. Just throw that. Bro, what? Oh my gosh, Kyler. How are we missing those? Okay, that's really bad. Oh, I think I'm cooked here. 
It looks like he's, he honestly might kill the clock on us and potentially go for three. I'm going to drop back way more coverage than what I was doing. I was trying to blitz him, and he's actually picking it up super well. He's got a lot of good linemen, as I had kind of previously mentioned. Young Desmond! Give me those. Thank you, defense! I freaking love you. Oh my gosh, thank you defense, I love you. Okay. Oh, brother. Okay, one first down away. I gotta run the ball a little bit. Palmer, if you hold on to that, I love you, bro. GG's, okay, needed it. We got two tough games. We get, we're, take the long flight back from Australia. Get me out of here. Oh, I'm worried, man, in the playoffs. I just feel like this whole season has lacked rhythm. I don't have a lot of rhythm, but I got a lot of wins. Like, I'm having a good season, but I'd be lying if I said it wasn't a bit of a dumpster fire. GG's. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is where it starts to matter. Like I said, I uh, we're good, but we're like, I don't even know how to describe this, man. We're in like this, I don't feel that, like we're winning. But like, we, I think I suck. I don't know. I, I don't know how to feel about this season. Like, I don't, I don't feel that confident, which is not good at all. I need to go back to some old school route combos. I got to do better against the blitz. The defense is there and it's not there at the same time. Like, I love this team. I've had a lot of fun and my record shows that we're, we're doing something clearly right. But at the end of the day, I, I got to be honest with myself. I think if I go into playoffs right now, I'm not convinced I won the Super Bowl. I think I'm decent. But for whatever reason, I just, I don't know what it is. I just feel like a little bit bleh in my game plan in just a lot of, I kind of want to move Higgins to the slot. And then just to open up some routes, I think having a big body receiver could be big. This is a big time game we're playing right here. Uh, I think I... I, you lose track of where the heck these teams are. This is PDX freaking perimeter. I don't even know. PDX. What the heck is PDX? That's the problem with this league. I don't know. Pioneers. Portland Pioneers. Portland PDX, I guess. Okay, we're going to Portland. No, Portland's coming to Oklahoma. Guys, we're the one seed. Um... Essentially, next week, we play against the other guy with uh, who has two losses. That game's going to be huge, that Week 18 game for the one seed. I think either way, I think that's the one that will determine it. But let's win this one. Try and keep bodies in front of him, and I think that discouraged him from taking off and made him try a pass downfield. Bro, that's, like, this is what I'm saying. That's not a good throw at all. That's not a good throw at all, man. There it is. There it is. T. Higgins. Maybe like, maybe that's the spot for Higgins. It's just something a little bit more like something where he's more actively involved in the play to play. Good job, Kyler. I'm out. Safety. Safety. Brett, your user sucks, man. Oh, that's horrible. That's horrible. So still backed up, but the situation not as dire now. First and ten at the fourteen. Now a dump off here complete. Room past the thirty-five. Across midfield. He's tired, though. He's tired. That's, that's I guess, the good thing he is tired. Here's Levis. Got him. Yo. Kaderko. You kind of knew that was your combo there. I put, uh, I put him there to pick that. Ooh, he's taking three. That's smart. Especially because he does. I think I got stopped. So, yeah, he gets ball at half. He's up 10-0. Like, he's got no reason to try and like press here. You take your points. Okay. Offense, we need we need way better. Murray now to throw. 
He'll fire deep downfield for Lamb. That's caught inside the 20. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Playing, uh, he was playing drop back zones. Like, um, I think he was in double flat, or at least he was. So eventually, CD's going to run in front of him. And CD's made a lot of big catches this year. So I have more confidence in him than I do in. I can't run, but I have more confidence in him right now than I do in T. Higgins. He has a timeout, doesn't he? I actually think I'm better off leaving him at the two, going for it and trying to leave him at the two. Just win potential. Win potential, I feel like I'm better off at least trying to, yeah, go for this. He dropped it. Nah, that's a tough read. Definitely could be wrong there, and I I am 100% admitting to being wrong. I just I thought maybe leaving him here wouldn't be the worst thing in the world, but I don't. I also don't think it's the best thing in the world. Like what am I doing defensively right now? I gotta I gotta just get it together, man. Like that is. Okay, we need to just. Total mental, even though, yeah, we need a, we need to completely refresh mentally here. Levis to throw it. Throw left side complete. That's Stevenson. You got to figure if we're going to have any chance, this, this is needing, needing badly to be a stop. Levis throwing for it on fourth. There it is. Okay, good defense. Okay, offense, if we can get in the end zone here, there's a chance. I. It's not It's not a great chance, but there is somewhat of a chance. Good job, Lamb. Lamb, you're actually maybe the best receiver I've ever used. Like... No joke. You might be the best receiver I've used this year. Like that's he has made some quite honestly just ridiculous catches. He's literally like sending freaking two here. I don't know. I don't know, man. He's sending two out of it. I'd probably have all day if I said I gotta go for it. I there's no what am I gonna do? Take three here? I I've missed so many point opportunities this game. It doesn't it doesn't freaking matter at this point. Yeah, GGs. I can't. It's the two man rush with everyone drop back. I can't freaking move. Okay, let's just cross our fingers. We don't have to go to Portland in the playoffs. I don't even know if what conference Portland's in. I don't know if it's East, West, NFC, AFC. I don't freaking know. All I know is literally he stopped me four times in the red zone. So it's as simple as I can put it. Next week's everything. Next week's for the one seed. I got to get it together and I got to win because. This was an embarrassment in the red zone. We literally just could not move. We'll figure it out. Okay, we'll see you guys week 18. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, oh, that game could have potentially clinched for us because this guy ended up losing um, in his game. He is the VB Virginia Beach. Snowhawks. We have the tiebreaker over the Snowhawks. He has the tiebreaker over him. Virgi literally Virginia Beach Redwoods I didn't know I didn't know you could move a team to uh, Virginia Beach the Redwoods of Virginia Beach is who it looks like we are about to be playing um, Virginia Beach Redwoods this is uh, this is for the number one seed I oh my gosh my team's really good too but this is a squad. This guy did well. He obviously went in after Josh Allen and then still had a lot remaining. Um, so if we win this, 
we get the number one seed. If we lose this, we obviously um, we obviously don't. We're gonna we're gonna fall down a little bit if we lose this. So we gotta lock in. We gotta be smart. We gotta just do everything right. Do the little things right. Don't overthink it and get a win. I have to just slow things down. I gotta run the ball here. I gotta make way better decisions than last week because last week we still have no breakouts. Even like to go into the playoffs as a one seed would just be such a whew, and a momentum um, booster and a confidence booster um, for me. So I'd love this. Ladies and gentlemen, week 18, Virginia Beach at home. Let's go. Second and four. Come on, T. Higgins. Good throw. So I realized that whoever I played last week's in the NFC. So if I see him, it's going to be in the bowl. And hopefully, hopefully, hopefully I don't see him because that was a dumpster fire. Good throw. Ingram wants to go to Cabo for a week on the bye week. Oh my, Ingram. Bail me out, dude. Holy, I'm getting bailed out right now. CD's going to win that every single time. That, there's like, that's the one receiver I'm throwing that to every freaking day of the week. Red zone offense sucks. Try and run it in because, come on, Spears, we need you, bro. We need you so bad, man. You're faster than Skinner. You gotta be. How do you run against this, though? I can't do the same thing I did last game. I honestly can't. I have to. Oh, thank gosh. <laughs> Holy moly, thank gosh. I can breathe. I literally, we just got stopped four times in a row last game. So thank goodness. Ah. Uh. Got him. Okay. Dude, don't be dumb. Don't be dumb. You got 215. He does get ball at half. Do not be dumb. Like, please, Brett, for once in your life, man, make an intelligent decision. Come on, Kyler. Yes, slide. Any other team that's not bad. This this guy has three inside stuff. Any other team that's not bad. He has three inside stuffs on this team. Ooh, I have to pass, I think. I, I honestly think I do. Murray sets to throw on four. And they hit him in line ready for their next drive. And we'll see if they can bounce back from that last drive. See that like that needed to be points. It just did. It needed to be points. I'll I'll be the first to own it. It did. Good job, Ben. Playing great defensively, but that that doesn't always last on this like we we can start really not being good very quickly. And we've shown that. Shown that many times. He's still short. And he gets this to the 48, but no further. Well short of the line to gain. Allen gonna go on fourth down. You just gotta make a tackle. Let's go, Minka. We're screaming right now. We are screaming right now and literally just trying to take stuff away. Three is fine. You got you got two stops. Don't fumble. Don't fumble. Three is fine. I have I have two stops in this game, which is a win. So freaking lays. Go right back to it, blues. Go right back to it, blues. 
they get in that fourth down spot again. Yeah, one would think so. Yeah, I just run out. I would say just don't throw a pick here, maybe. They're gonna look to throw. Proceeds to almost throw a pick. Take three. Honestly, take three and play more defense. I don't. I don't know, man. We're not buzzing. We need a team meeting before the playoffs. Like we gotta talk. Oh. That's a book. That's a book. It's a snuggy, man. It's a snuggy right now. If you lose this, Brett, honestly, I would just quit. I think I got one on one with CD Lamb. That should. No. Like, what am I doing? It's his defense versus my defense. I don't. Why am I trying to be a hero all the time? Just literally, stop trying to be smart. You're not smart, Brett. That's such a beam. Don't. Just get out of here. I don't know. I can't. I can't stop anybody. I can't move. I'm making dumb decisions. Like. I don't even know right now. I this game needs should have been over, man. It's on me if I lose this. To the opposite side. And all of a sudden, you've got a battle on your hands. When in doubt, man. When in doubt. Like, whole season in shambles. We're struggling. Everyone, nobody can move. What a, why? I'm looking at him. Why throw it? You're literally staring at him. Oh, my gosh. What is wrong with my eyes? Am I, is it, is it my old, like, I'm 26 now. Am I, like, can I just not see when someone's blatantly freaking covered on third down? Am I, can I not see it? Oh, my gosh. This, there's no reason this should be even a game. Oh. Do your, I'm just gonna do my best to, to stop him here. Make things difficult. Don't let him just run it. Make him like make him have to work for it. I think is is definitely an important aspect of this whole thing. I just like he's probably thinking like I don't even need seven right now. Brett Brett cannot move at all. So he's probably realistically content with three points. That's, that, that's really great defense by me. That's really good defense. Thank you, defense. Tajay Spears, if he takes three, can we just win, man? He's not going to. Oh, brother. You got me. Congratulations. Okay. I don't know. Money drive, guys. Money drive to win. Money drive for the one seed. Kyler, we suck. Money drive for the one seed. Like, I just don't know how I can make so many fourth down like mistakes in a row. Unless the Hawks, did the Nighthawks beat this guy? In which case, I don't know how this tiebreaker works. Maybe we will get it either way. I have no freaking clue because He's behind the Snowhawks, but he'll have it over me. Honestly, the freaking Snowhawks might get the number one seed. We might go to like eight after this. I don't even know, man. Okay. Back to throw. Murray. 
T, I need more separation, man. At some point here, I'm going to take a risk to CD Lamb. Like, it's just inevitable. That's that's the guy who I think gives me the best chance. Like, at some point, I feel like the, the risk has to go to CD Lamb. If we're talking, like, just from a pure just football standpoint, he's been my best player, so... Nice, Brett. Nice, Brett. Take this 360 spin out the window. I'm raging. I don't even care if I lost the one seat on that. Biggest choke of my life. Oh my gosh. Literally just like, I can't move, man. I'm just horrible. That was horrible. Okay, the only thing I can hope for is that the tiebreaker between the freaking Snowhawks and Redwoods, him being in front of him, I don't know at this point. We'll see you guys in the playoffs. I think we're going to have to earn it in the wild card. We're an absolute mess. Holy moly, schmoly doly. Let's dance. I don't know. I'm ready for the playoffs. If I'm playing in the wild, I need to play in the wild card. I need, I, if I go in divisional right now, do I fire my coach? I'm the coach. Oh. Okay. I had my moment. I had my weak moment. Now we figure it out. Now we figure it out. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm human, man. I, uh, this is a sell. I have, uh, sorry to everyone from Oklahoma City for the absolute sell of the century of the one seed. Like, just... Just horrendous. Um, I'm trying to think of what I can say other than I got to win four games. Four people have to beat me, and we can win the Super Bowl. With, with the confidence I'm playing with right now, that might not happen, but that, that's where you got to flip it. Um, this is probably... Oh, the, the, the receivers aren't that good. Honestly, I think we can play man bump against this guy. His defense is TJ Watt, Dexter Lawrence, Aaron Donald, Alexander, Jonathan, La oh, Marshawn Lattimore. Oh, brother. Okay. Um, guys, at the end of the day, I don't want to let this be a meme. Okay. No matter what, I'm going to be back tomorrow. I'm not, I'm not, I don't quit. I don't care. You won't see me quit. I'm going to. I love this job and I'm angry at myself and I'm letting you guys down, but I'm going to do everything I can. The one seed doesn't matter. If I win this, the one seed's negated. We get our confidence right back. Big game against the Golden Eagles. Um, is it going to be easy? Absolutely not. But it is what it is. I don't know. We're at home. We have the home field advantage. He's got a 95 overall defense. Blue field. Let's go. Oh, first playoff game in Oklahoma City, bro. First playoff game in OKC. Nothing else matters. Win the game. I got to just relax my entire temperament. I got a Starbucks drink here. I literally ordered that Starbucks drink after the last game because I was like, bro, I got to chill out, man. I was literally just losing it. But relax. Win the ball game. First play from scrimmage. Here's Murray. That's all right. Cannot believe this is who we get to play in this game. That's completed right side to Palmer. Get downfield. Good job. I'm just taking the first. He's got he's got an insane D line. Oh my goodness. That's a D line. If I've ever seen a D line, that is a D line right here. 
Good job, Spears. Come on, Spears. Come on, Spears. Third and two. On play action, it's Murray. Pass taken in by his big tight end. He's got the first down and more. Look at the big man on there. That's how we gotta score, man. It's gotta be like freaking 50 yard drags. Like, I I can't, I got no red zone, and this defense is insane. So, that's literally how we have to score. Okay, play defense. Okay, he's got Mahomes, but like, very average receivers. So, Gibbs, I feel like, is gonna be a huge part of his offense. Because his receivers aren't that special. So what I'm banking on is I need I need to stop the run. Like, I need to stop the run. That's good defense. What I say, he doesn't have receivers. He's got a lot of good going, but not a lot of... Crazy talent on there. Nope, he doesn't have that. He's gonna be short. Something's got to give. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Will. Looking to throw is Mahomes. And that one into the hands of Ayuk downfield. And all the way in for the touchdown. Brandon Ayuk. Okay, this is the problem. He's got 93 overall defense. I will punt in this game. Mark my words. If I am not getting where I need to get. I have to trust this defense um, with something. His defense is so good. I'm not banking on like just being able to drive however I want to drive. So, the end of the day, man. Oh, let's go. Come on, Palmer. Like that to me is that's everything that I've that's everything that I've harped on on myself. Like everything that I've said I'm doing so poorly is summed up in that play. Like literally had a short read, didn't take it, waited too long, did something stupid. Like pretty well sums us up. Okay, punt the ball. I just got a bank kind of stop at this point. I got no offense. Like, I think I can get stopped, so. I don't know at this point, man. Oh, that was a horrible drive. On first down, Mahomes. Ryan Neal, you've been our best player all year, man. Why would that change? Why would that change in the playoffs? Stop testing me, bro. Ryan Neal, you've been our best player all year. Why would that change? Let's go. Okay. This is why we're punting is because our defense is good also. So it's like... I The way I see it, it's... No, nope, I'll take that all day. He was worried he was going to get weak boxed. Here, I think I got to try and throw a little bit down the field. I got to throw down the field there because it's it's end short, so like it's first and five. So in that situation, I feel like you got to kind of go for that. Good go, Higgins. There it is. On first 
Go, go Spears. Okay, this has been, this has been what we've been worst at. And it's such a, he's, he's got such an elite level. Great blocking. Here comes third and goal. I'm I'm crazy. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. I'm running it. I'm running it. Don't care. I can't pass in the red zone, so I'll run. I'm crazy. Third down. Oh brother. I think I'm actually kind of crazy right now. 14-7. Let's go. Mad Max. Mad freaking Max. There it is. Crosby. Everybody. Get our swag back. Will Anderson. That's okay. Just don't don't let it be a huge run. That's fine. Don't let it be anything crazy. Don't let it be anything crazy. Come here. It's a Snuggie, bro. It's a freaking Snuggie score. One seed for what? One seed for nothing. Stop talking, Brett. You've blown leads like this before. But honestly, his Achilles... That's, I punted! You guys should be so happy. I got to 4th and 20 on the second drive. I wasn't stupid. I punted the ball. Boom. Good things are happening. I gotta start listening to you more. I'm not gonna call a timeout. On the off chance I don't stop this. That's what I'm saying. On the off chance I don't stop this. I'm, I'm thankful I didn't take a timeout. Oh, Ayuk. Ayuk, Ayuk, Ayuk. As the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. Mahomes now on first down. Marlin! Marlon, why are you the way you are, Marlon? Oh, I thought I... I thought I had that. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. And it's caught. Touchdown. That's it. And I think in this situation, that's the proper play. But we do know there's some risk takers out there. Evan Ingram, I don't know if that we, we're going to get a field goal out of this. Now whistles and a timeout with three seconds left in the first half. What's his kick power? I just don't. 63. It's saying he can hit the kick. So three seconds here remain in the half. I think he's short, man. I think he's points. short. This was the old NFL record distance for decades, a 63-yard attempt. Uh, they told me to go for it. I should have went to Hill Mary, but at least okay, kept it safe. Guys, defense, we just need another stop. Simple as that. Defense, like, I pick six, whatever we can do. Get Mahomes off the freaking field because his defense is too much. That's some of the best defense we've played. That might, that might be the best defense we've played today. Come on, Spears. 
Way to fight for me, Spears. Way to fight for me, bro. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Like seriously, what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh my gosh, what was that sack? I could have probably ran for that first down three times. Oh my gosh. think they'd like to get him a little help now on third down and move it closer. Shotgun now for Murray. Take three. Take three. Take three. I don't know. We're a disaster. Take three. So now one of the biggest kicks of the night is forthcoming. This to break our fourth quarter tie. Koo knocks this one through the park. As they go to work on a crucial, crucial drive first and ten. And he takes this up to the 40 yard. Neglected. Nice little burst right there. Going back to Gibbs on first down. And he'll be taken. That time, he made sure the only guy was going to catch it was sitting in the third row. That's not a fumble! What? Oh my gosh. Holy moly. That's okay. I'm full tilt, dude. I'm full tilt. Straight ahead with Gibbs here. And he'll be I'm full freaking tilt. Here's Mahomes. Short throw hauled in by Kelsey. Off the option. Here's Gibbs. And they got it in. <laughs> They'll look to throw. He's just blitzing, dude. He's honestly, he's just blitzing his whole team against me. Actually, that, that was close to being a dot. GG's, fellas. Oh my gosh. Let me see how far I can throw this. I sold. I sold like four games in a row. This is a complete meme. I will own that this was a meme. I am sorry. I got nothing. I don't know, man. I Sometimes I'm succeeding, and sometimes I'm freaking horrible. And I guess I'm freaking horrible. I just couldn't clutch up a game to save my life. No big plays. I couldn't win. Like, literally, it was just we were a dumpster fire. We were a complete and total freaking dumpster fire. We just got dotted in the late game in every freaking and honestly i apologize i feel bad i hate letting you guys down but like at the end of the day freaking a whatever i tried i suck i'll i don't know this whole league sometimes they're gonna be golden sometimes they're literally going to be awful i sold every game i sold every freaking game in this i don't know i'm gonna try and end this with something cool we might sim into the future once they're done the super bowl that that was disgusting i'm sorry you had to watch it but if you love me let me know you love me i'm trying i hate everything ggs oh this is this is what you pay to see man this is what you pay to see seahawks texans super bowl this is it man this is it 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 Corey Sargent. Whole squad, everybody. Oh, Dylan beat me. I beat him in the last two Super Bowls. He's beat me in this, but he beat me in the NFC Championship. We go back and forth. This I beat him last season in the opener, and I beat him twice in this league last season. 
no guarantees whatsoever. We got, we got no dev upgrades by anybody, but we already we're, we got a good team dev wise. So I'm not overly shocked about that. I don't. No part of me is like, oh, I should have gotten these devs. No, I, I don't feel that way. But this team that Dylan has is really good. I think it's better than last year, which is room for concern. Um, but also, I'm confident. I, I want to go back to back. He's got Jaden Daniels as his QB. Kenneth Walker, 99 overall. DK Jackson. Ooh, he lost. See, I don't think his team's as good as it was last year, actually. He lost Jackson. Derek Hall. Nwosu. This is where he's kind of gross. That guy's disgusting. You don't even look at him. If you see him, you know, you turn over, you turn the other way. And Jamal Adams. <sighs> My game plan, dude, I just I just want to go back to back. He didn't actually play that much this year. So he he took a ton of losses. He only played, I think, ten games. I think he took seven losses because he was a, he was gone and he won all ten games. He has not lost. Um, so don't get let his record confuse you. He just was not here. So, guys, Super Bowl Atlanta. A chance to run it back with CJ. Let's go. Here's Walker to start the drive. Room here to run. Freaking tough toenails, man. Every time I, you know, there's like two different mind games going on now. So every time Dylan plays, he runs on his first play. And I always run commit, but I'm always like, eventually dude is going to one time he'll stop doing that and come see come saw he stopped go braylon go braylon this play killed him last time go braylon james i'm gonna need you to go braylon james to the castle are you not entertained bro two plays two touchdowns Right, if you want to play three three five wide, man, I'm gonna I'm gonna get on the outside. Braylon James, you guys already know. You already know what he can do. Seven up. How is that the read? How is that the read, man? Defense. Oh my gosh, Petrie, get there, man. Get to him, Petrie, get to him. Back. Christian Harris. My gosh, Christian Harris. Oh, that's a W adjustment. That's a W adjustment. I sent the whole freaking crib there. Okay, we are close. Mm. I, I knew I was torched on the on the corner. I knew I knew I was torched on both plays. So, oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. That's a ridiculous play. There we go. Give me those. Oh my gosh, the play before. Talk about getting cheated. Talk about getting cheated. Come here. Get over here. Good defense. I left him. I left him for the crosser. I left him for the crosser. Come here, bro. Like at some point, one of these, like one of these, has gotta go. One of these has gotta go. 
driving downfield, but they never did. On third down, he'll drop to throw. Don't give up on the rope, right? Don't give up on the route. He stays in three. It's kind of his personality. He knows he's going up 10, but I, I look at that as a win. Honestly, this guy gets a lot of touchdowns. So, to me, I look at that as a dub. I look at that as a dub. Nice catch, Bowers. Nice catch, Bowers. Catch Bowers. Stroud to the air on first and ten. Looking left sideline, it's complete. Now the Seahawks. Okay. We get a timeout for him. That's that's the good thing. We get a timeout for him. Just under 40 ticks to go in this first half. Oh, they're gonna run a little pop pass here. Get a second timeout. Beam. Good job, Marvin. Good job, Marvin. Good job, Marvin. Good job, Marvin. He caught it. That should guard that. Metcalf should be covered and the deep post should be covered. Give me those! Four seconds. I'm taking three. Tie this game up. Tie this game up. Boom! Sting like a freaking bee. Okay. Offense, we got a chance to go up by seven. That was, oh my gosh, the clutchness of Stingley. I wanted to, I wanted to house that. I tried to go juke a little left, right, but I tried to house it. Didn't work is what it is. Let's dance. Second half adjustments. Offense, I think I figured them out better in the that second drive. The first drive was good. Well, it was a one play touch. And that second drive was a lot better. So, a lot of corner routes. He's taking away the middle really well. So, I just have to focus on corner routes, jet sweeps, all those things. There we go. Okay. It's a dog, fellas. It's a dog. Good throw. Okay. This is this is the little things that win the win games, man. I'm gonna put Bowers there. I'm gonna put Bow. I don't want Bowers to lose double me. So because I don't want every single time Bowers is out there, he's creating a double team. So I'm gonna put him here so that he gets a catch, so that he keeps double me. I don't. I don't even care that that went backwards. That's just so that that he continues to have that ability. The little things, man. Little things that make a big difference. Now Bowers maintains having double me every single play because it's it's all about targets. So now he he still has that ability. Probably set me up for a money drive to win. I have to. I hate it, but I have to. And I'm almost out of space on my computer. No! No way! No freaking way, dude. It's going right back to the bag. That's a bag. That time, that time, that's a bag. That time, that's a bag. Oh gosh! I thought I, I thought I had him lurked on that last play. Yeah. 
short passing game, you should be above 60% just to be in the average range. Toward the sideline. And they'll look to throw here on first down. Dance into his left. STAGLEY! Bro! Flowing like a butterfly! Sting like Lee! That's the, that's, that's the best interception I've ever seen. That was Jason Bourne. That was Jason... My chair stuck. That was Jason Bourne. Oh. My. Goodness. That's the best interception I've ever seen. And good job. Bro. That, those are the type of things that create dynasties. When I say dynasty, Stingley's game today is what helps create dynasties. Frick. That's the best pick I've ever seen in my life. That's just a, that, that's hot. That's a hot dot. That is, throwing that above Tariq Woolen is just different. Hot freaking dot. Braylon James up top. Slow things down. The clock away from seven. Seven almost seals it. Oh, he almost he he almost got the animation. He's manning him up now. He's manning up Bowers. You just can't man up Bowers. You just cannot man up Brock Bowers. Okay. See, the way I would normally look at this is a field goal is okay. It really like he still has three timeouts so like I want to clock him but like three points I'm up by six he money drives and wins a Super Bowl you know what I mean like that's the way I'm looking at this right now like yeah that would be great but like So it's a good pick. I can't. I can't. I can't get a good pick and then watch him get a good pick and be mad. I have to just respect what I just saw, and what I just saw was a really good pick. Bag. Bag. Lucas. Ben. Box. Oh my gosh! It's a box out here. It's. Oh. It's not about CJ. I'm stuck in my heated blanket. It's not about CJ. It's not about CJ. It's about a team. It's about a team that wants it. My chair is still continuously stuck. 27-17. End it, Brett. End it. Inbounds. I gotta fix my chair. I gotta fix my chair. Stingley won us this. It, it, honestly, don't let the record books tell you anything other than the fact that Derek Stingley is the MVP of this game. Don't let the record say anything but that. Derek Stingley is the MVP of this game. Oh, that's not good. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. Okay. I gotta fix my seat. Dude, I can't with my seat. I can't with my seat. I'm getting rid of this entire thing. I can't, I don't care about my carpet. I can't, I can't with this seat. I'm gonna lose my mind. Literally. I can't with my seat right now. Oh, because it's six, he's going onside. Don't you dare let him get this. He's got three timeouts, he's actually, and then it's a shorter field. Back 
to throw. Go ahead, touchdown. And you and I both know this is where you need a quarterback who can keep. He takes it across for the touchdown and they take on this drive. And doesn't that just sum up football? We see it all the time, don't we? The defense goes from losing the battle to making a huge play and stealing the momentum. So you know they're riding high right now. He can't guard that while he's still trying to guard Woolen. That's out of bounds. Things start to get more interesting here in the second half. Now Stroud. And the throw loosening up a couple of extra steps that allowed him to run with him stride for stride. Stroud buying time to his left. Now he'll turn and throw deep back to the other side of the field. Here's Stroud. Working the sideline here, did he? I have to. I have to go to the end zone. Stroud to throw it. And this is in from the twenty-one. It's second and ten. One final shot. They'll look to throw. Madden tried, dude. Madden tried. Madden tried. He, they tried. Madden, Madden tried their best. Madden tried their best. I see you, Madden. I see you giving them onside kicks. I'll remember this, Madden. I'll remember this. Don't worry. I'll remember that. I'll remember that. I promise I will remember the onside kicks. I promise. I promise. Just make sure that when, it, when the game's on the line, I'm going up top to Brock Bowers. Legend in the city of Houston. Just know when the game and the money is on the line. Where are the balls going? You tried, Madden. Thank you. Good effort. Good effort. Like I said, good effort. You tried. It was cool. It was a cute effort. But at the end of the day, better man won. Better man was me today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a second channel where I post golf every day. Make me the happiest person in the world by go subscribe. Check out that channel. There's a link down below. My Instagram is tdbarrettyt. My Twitter is tdbarrettyt. Thank you guys so much for watching. Kill the like button. Um, go watch another video here. And like I said, go subscribe to my second channel.